channel. If you're new to my channel, hi, my name is Gloria Hings. Thank you so much for stopping by. So in today's video, I'm going to be telling you guys all about this hair. Is it my hair? Is it extensions? Is it a U part wig? What is it? <laughs> if you're interested in knowing how I got my hair to look like this and what hair this is, just stay tuned and keep on watching. So this hair is from Curls Queen. It came in this really nice pink packaging and with with a bow as well. Turkish Customs wanted to embarrass me. They took out the bow. Regardless of that, I still received the package and it came beautifully. It came in this really nice pink box, very sturdy box. When you open the package, you're welcomed with this bag this pink bag i think it's pink or peach i don't know what color that is and that bag contains the hair it also has like a, a mini bag i would say a thank you card as well as the um user manual or the manual on how to take care of the hair now i'm going to open this mini bag it comes with this brush guys i use this brush to blow dry my hair and it worked perfectly well it also came with this box for the extra paint i really love that they brought extra paint as well as a bonnet if you don't want to take out the clippings you can just put your hair in the bonnet and keep going and it's a drawstring bonnet so it's not tight on your edges so now i'm going to take out the hair and show you guys what it looks like it's the coarse kinky blowout clipping extension set it's the one bundle set for a full head. The length is 18 inches. So this is what it's looking like. You can see it's coarse. You can see it's giving kinky straight. You know when you straighten your natural hair, if you have long natural hair, this is what it would look like. So it's definitely giving that. For this hairstyle, I decided to blow dry my hair, but I blow dried my hair in medium heat. I just wanted to stretch out my hair. We're going to go straight into the installing process. Well, first of all, I'd like to show you my braiding pattern just so you guys understand the concept I have to install this hair. I may or may not straighten my hair depending on how my hair blends with the extensions. I have my front section here and I also have leave out around the perimeter of my head. And I just did like big, really big cornrows going down and just, you know, joined everything together down to the last one. And I just tucked the ends into itself i did not have so much going on with the leave out part and yeah that's pretty much that's pretty much it for my leave out i just have my cornrows going to the back so the clipping comes in the basic set which is two of the five clips clipping two of the four set clippings two of the three set clippings and four of the four set of the two set clippings so that's 10 pieces wefts in general I don't know if I'm ever going to get this whole clipping situation. I'm just going to brush it using the brush it came with. I'm going to set my hair straightener to the 392. That's the middle heat because there's like five heat parts. So I'm setting it to 392 and I'm going to just slightly pass the hair straightener over it because this is what the hair looks like when it is brushed. But my hair does not have these waves, so I may as well just take away the waves and just put it on my hair. So I'm going to take the five clip clippings that I've already straightened and I'm going to attach that to the back section. As usual, like I always say when I do clipping videos, I want I would apply it in a U shape. Applying it in a U shape means you don't have like the bulky edges and it just sits perfectly on your head. Why I like to comb my hair or twist my hair before applying the clippings on my hair is because one, I don't want to apply it directly to my scalp. I like to apply it on the braid itself and not on my scalp. And two, I, I have like full hair. I don't think I would want to apply the clipping plus my hair together because that's just going to be extremely full. I like to just use leave out whenever I'm using clippings instead of using my hair with the clippings. I'm also going to take the four clips clipping and just stretch it out. Now you wanna blame me 
Like you have no options, I take your options. Now I'm not the problem, man. That's on you. This is what the hair is looking like. I still have two extra clippings left. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take out the front leave out and see how what I can do with that. No, let me take out the leave out at the side first. I'm going to make it part down the middle. This is what the hair is looking like once I just used my blow dried hair and tried to blend it with the clippings. I can still see the difference, however, I feel some people can go out like this, but for me, I would never go out like this with my hair not being blended well. I'm going to use my hair straighteners. I'm going to put it on the lowest heat possible. So I'm going to stretch it in smaller sections. I'm going to use this heat protectant, damage control, Tony and Guy, I don't know, this is what I'm going to use. I'm just going to spray a little bit. That was not a little bit, that was quite a lot, but massage that into the hair and then make two parts. The tangle. You guys, I've not straightened my hair in a long time. I don't know what this is going to look like. Bring me down, stronger now. So this is what it looks like not straightened and this is what it looks like straightened. So I'm going to do the same thing to the other side and show you guys the final results. So I'm going to go use a mirror to see what's going on and then I'm going to finish up my makeup and come back and show you guys the end results, okay? So I'm back. I think it's a habit now for me to put my hair in a scarf. But I put it in a scarf when I was trying to change my top so it doesn't mess up the hair. So let's see if that helps in any way. Okay. I mean, I'm not mad. This hair is, yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure you guys are feeling this hair already. I am actually proud of myself as to how much I attempted to blend it. I was trying to use my hair to do like cotton bangs, <laughs> which is obviously not working out. I probably should not do that. Anyways, this is what the hair is looking like. I can go out like this and people will think it's my hair. Like literally people, non-black people would think this is my hair. Well, it's on my head, so you'll be alright. Like I'm absolutely loving this hair. The elegance is there, but it's just laid back. We're not doing too much, but you know if you know you know i love the blend the bl it blended very well with my hair especially after using the scarf i don't think using the hair straightener was necessary i could have just gone in with the blow dryer on high heat and just blended it properly but me being me i just wanted to try it out i'm going to try to compose that so you guys can see like the blend it's blended properly and i'm in love with it okay i'm going to try to style this hair in different styles maybe try a ponytail oh i can scratch my scalp <gasps> you know how when you have wig on or when you have like hair extensions on and you just don't expect to reach your scalp that's the good thing about clippings you can still feel your scalp you can still take care of your hair underneath it you can take them out and put them back on and just go about your day. I'm going to try to style this hair in different styles just to see what would work. Maybe I should have known I 
Alright guys, so I've come to the end of my video. I hope this video was really easy to follow and let me know if you guys would purchase this hair. If you have maybe like 3C, 4A hair and you straighten your hair or blow dry your hair, it will definitely match with your hair. But I'm actually impressed at the way it matched with my 4C hair. If you're going to purchase this hair, it's from Carl's Queen. You should definitely check it out. All of the details I mentioned are going to be in the description box below. So please make sure you check it out. Let me know what you guys think about this style. What do you think about my blending method? Do you think I tried? Would you go out with your hair like this? I can definitely go out with my hair like this. I will go out with my hair like this. It's giving the style I wanted to give. Um, I've come to the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. <laughs>